got the Tiga bites and the floor. Now I've come here, I don't know what to expect. Oh, I told you I'm going with Fernley. This is my fern bush. I've got a lovely bush. I'm doing this just recording live. I don't know what to expect, but I've got a grey feather. That's like a grey alien. I've got to the right of me, I've got Alexandra. Oh God, the fucking Alexandra. That's the woman's version of an Alexander. I'm the ER of the team, the medical examiner. I'm going to fucking slice your fucking brains up. Oh, I don't think I'm allowed in. i got to fucking... Let's see, this is what they do. Lock the fucking graveyard. I'm going over the wall. I'm going over the wall. Oh, no. I think it's still open. Let's have a look. Sorry, I got distracted. Oh, it's still open. So we're going in here, look. An overgrown one of them still got heads on the angels here. Look at this. I mean, look at that fucking tree. That's a fucking tree, is it? Hold on, I need to. Oh, you've got Elizabeth and John here already. I love Elizabeth and John's dead ones. <laughs> 74. Look at this. Oh, look at this graveyard. Fernley's fucking here. This is my time. I love graveyards. I fucking love graveyards. So Birmingham is full of history. This is where the first revolution happened in... Oh, Richard and Charles. Oh, God, you fucking Charles again. Look at this. I mean, look at that. How beautiful is that? It's much better than I am. Isn't that much nicer? I mean, isn't it? Do you not just love fern bushes? I'm going to take some home and take it and put it in my bedroom again. I'll put it on my throne seat for you to see tonight. Isn't that fucking awesome, man? That's just the best thing in my whole life. It's overgrown with fern bushes. <laughs> rise of the dead. All rise, all rise. Oh, and we've got a cricket match going on to the right of me as well as cricket season. Down under in Queensland. Look at this one. He's still got his head on. In Handsworth, all the graveyards, all the angels had knee heads. No, heads in the graveyards. They, 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 ah, there was a big sign at the top of the thing in hands worthy, not worthy, was Loki. Written in spray for the paint. Mother God damn fuckers. No fucking respect. So this one's for you today, live boys who are serving. We've, we've sort of celebrating the dead, so I'm here because I like the dead better than the living. I don't like humans. <laughs> oh, look, see, here we go. This one's for you. Dead people, see, this is why I come. Look at this. Look at this, man. Look at that. Look at that. It missed whoever T.A. Moore was. Royal Air Force. I told you I'm the fucking goddamn love. This is God's gift to me today. This is the best one. I've had gifts all day, but look at that. 19th of November, 1918. Now, when I was 18 and 19 in 1988 and 89, that's when the, the military man fucked me again. The dodgy veterans of the assholes. That's why I support the real military because I'm leading on to this boy. So unless we forget the dead, as I talk with the dead, you can follow me live soldiers who are the ones who've done Iraq and had to put up with that bloody bullshit of 9-11. Fuck me off that fucker. I was working, by the way, guys, at the Marriott, which, if you're anybody who knows anything, the Marriott was at the Metro Centre, which was at the Gates Heed. I was at the gates heed when I was 21. Don't worry, I've been doing this a long fucking time. Never fear, cat's here. All right, celebrating the dead week. That's me, I'm dead to all of you. When you lose someone you love, you can gain an angel you know. That's why I've got loads of angels with me, because they're all fucking dead. You killed every fucker I fucking met. Oh, look. Frank Law. Franklin. Cheeky motherfucker. Hold on, what we got here? Oh, look, you like this one, boys. Girls. I say boys just for the soldiers. Look at this. Look at that. Isn't that a nice headstone. Militaries always have the best headstones. This is the Royal Garrison Artillery. 2nd of July, 1907-22. I mean, come on. You can't tell me that's not sexy. <laughs> I find this sexy along with an inhabitant jet. <laughs> that's why I'm in the army. Good. Rest. And these are the Celtic Mason ones. This is the Mason boys. See the symbol? Yeah, you with me? Oh, 444 four, four on the clock. It's all for the fours. We're the all 44s. We're still in a time, Lyman boys. Of the spiritual army. Daisy Chase. Oh, look at this graveyard. I'm so excited. Look at this. 
Son's there. I'm not really with the dead to people. I'm still alive. I'm not dead. I'm not going to die. Look, we have orbs and everything. So then we travel to here. Look, it's a huge... They've never had fern bushes like this in my life in a graveyard. This is the best gift I've got. It's great every day. I'm fucking telling you. This is makes me happy. <laughs> She got the fucking graveyard. I guess she's fucking nuts there. Yeah, I am nuts, me. Nuts! <laughs> That's why I'm a hunter gatherer. Look at this. Oh, this one's for Emma. Oh, my grandma had an next one Emma called Emma. They killed her, didn't they? Little birdie. Oh, they've chopped its wing off. I don't know what it is. Oh, probably the swallow. And there's the lilies. See? My grandma was a lily. Oh my God, Fernley, you're fucking, I can't believe you brought me. This is St. John's, by the way, and, 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 what do you call him? I don't know what the church is called, I don't do church shit. Look at this. Fernley's everywhere today, I can't believe it. <laughs> well, I can, I just can't believe it, I'm catching it on camera for you. Look at that. Fern bush at this side as well. Look at the size of the fucking fern bushes. <laughs> they never have them this big. Never. <coughs> you see what they do, me? Really? What is this? They fucking bury shit under it, you know. I mean, look at this, it's got a hole in the Hello? Is that what you're doing with me? Are you watching me still trying to spy what I'm doing, peeping Tom man? Right, well, what I'm going to say, what I was going to say was, peace be with you all. And what I was going to say was, military boys and girls who are still alive. I don't like calling you girls because we're fucking hard, we're boys, we're just like the boys. If you're in the military and you're serving in fucking Iraq, you're a fucking bo boss boy bitch. We're all bitches like that. Anyway, military people. There's a huge scam going on online, right? Now I know this, you know this. I am the undercover boss online. So my major mission is just to go and fuck oh, this graveyard. is fucking awesome. Look at this! The boys are in the fan bushes! I think I might jump in there and do one of them things they do at the gigs. Where you do one of those flying things off and jump inside. Oh, it's awesome. This is fucking beautiful. I can't even really thank God enough for this. I mean, look. He's there. God's everywhere. See? Now you see me? No, you don't. Now you see me? Hello! Oh no, I'm dead. It's all right, I'm still alive. <laughs> still alive, sir. Don't worry, I know I'm me or I'll be missing in action. You've all missed me, ain't ya? I know I have, because that's why I'm the boss. Anyway. <coughs> Roses. See? Plants, flowers. This is all for me. This is my gift from God. I see. He says, what do you want to do? Like Saturday night. I want to have a date night with Stephen. That's not really Stephen. But Michael actually. Archangel is kind of my upstairs twin. And um military speaking. There's a scam online that's going on. It's like a huge onion layer. Now I went online just find my mission was Catherine, just do what you always do, you're gonna find love online. I'm like, I'm sure that's gonna work, Dad, full of fucking P doors. He says, That's why I need you. He says, because no one else will do it, and I can't trust anyone. And this is this is actually what you decided to do. Before you came down here, you just forgot. So I just wanted to keep forgetting and just love them all like motherfuckers. I said, all ah, right then. So I did. Now I met a military man, because they scam. I tell you what the biggest scam is. They use the US militaries of dead and alive people. They take their profiles and then they pretend really they're from Africa or they're from Romania or those are the two top two places where they do the scams for them, right? So what I did was I went on fucking line and this fucking dude, I love you, Catherine. This is my Garden of Eden experience of death, right? Eden's fucking Eden. You know who Eden is? It's Satan. He owns the world. Eden, Garden of Eden down here on earth, buried in earth. Right, so this fern, these fern bushes, I'm telling you, the dead's took over. <laughs> God, you're dead here, you're alive and kicking. So what I want to say is, what I'm trying, I can't, I'm too excited. Look at all these down there. <gasps> More fern bushes. I've never seen so many fern, oh, and that's a little feather. I've never seen so many fern bushes as all my holy, holy life. And I have a holy life, not holy socks like you guys. <laughs> Fucking hell, it's everywhere. Fern, you are, thanks for this, Dad, I love it. I call Fern my dad, he's not really, but he's one of my father figures. And then it's got Angel. Oh, it's an Angela. It's a Hansworth. Look at that. I mean, there's the ivy. See, the ivy's a creeper. It kills things and squashes things. The fern bushes just look like that. They just look nice and natural, floating in there above the tree. 
What happens when you turn around? Poison Ivy's taking over the fucking world, swamping the fucking... Covering my fucking graveyard. I can't even see my headstone. Ivy. All right, then, bitch. Tell your mother I say hello. <coughs> Sorry, don't mean to be rude or anything. I hope you're not upset about that. <laughs> Isn't it funny? Did you celebrate Christmas? Did you have a nice family Christmas every on Sunday night? By myself in a crack house, thanks to your mother's and father, Bonnie and fucking Clyde there, big boys, all of the big GGs. Well, I've got Fernley, and you've got a poisoned blue ivy. So that's a good idea, isn't it? Dead man walking, dead man's finger. And look, we've got John William Betty. That's a berry of a fruit. Fruit bats. Fucking goddamn fruit bats. <laughs> so the other thing, sorry, I keep getting distracted. I'm too excited. I love these places. Oh, I'm walking over their grave. They don't mind that. I'm allowed to do that. So, oh my God, it goes. It's like the. It's like a. A secret garden. They don't care for the grave. God's still there. Don't worry. I'm not going to die. I'll be killed. Can you see upstairs? Upstairs is still here. They love the dead too. Hello, everybody upstairs. You're here too, and the ship's coming out again. Look at this. I mean. I mean. Oh, I love it here. It's a nice feeling, this one. Oh, look. See this? You can see it there. Look at that. Fucking awesome, man. So, when you're online, they, they scam you, okay? And sorry, I'm getting a lot. I'm talking because there's a lot of dead people in my ears. I get I talk with the dead people talking to me, and they want to say a lot of stuff. But I really want to get this out about the military while I'm here, because lest we forget, we the military who are actually still alive, people, and they haven't died. Some of them are actually doing God's work. So what I wanted to say was, they use your profiles in the military and scam with your pictures and things. Now what they did was, guess what they did? You'll never believe this fucker did this to me. He sent me, oh, cat, I'm going to send you some money. I said, I don't believe it, I don't want your money. And da, 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 da. We had a whole quote. It's online, you can read all about it. And um, I said to him, he proved, I'm going to prove it. Oh, God, here we go. He's another fucker. He's obviously not who he is, because why are you proving that you want money to me? I don't give a shit that you want money. So he sent me a bank account details with, uh, he had a million quid in his bank or something. It's fake, obviously. I'm not an idiot. So, <laughs> so I said, oh, that's a good eight. Well done, Mr. E. Dan. E Dan of the scam of Saint Dan. That's why I'm an aura. Oracle of the Royal Army of the Corpse. It says crops actually, but I'm gonna say corpse. <laughs> 23rd of August, 1916, age 27. People died at that age. Oh well. Oh look. We've got the army of the ants. Ants are always with me. <laughs> In front. <laughs> anyway, so as I was saying. Mr. Eden sent me all his details. So then he said, I want you to be my next to kin in case anything happens to me when I'm in Iraq. So you're in Iraq. You're in Iraq. What kind of rack? <laughs> i tell you what kind of rack. He got me, this motherfucker. He's serving in the military from the USA, but he's working over line, online, in... I had to send him the money to Africa. I says, I thought you were in fucking Iraq. Oh, well, I am, but I can't cash it, and it's just the way the military work. Right, OK, oh, oh, this is fucking great. This motherfucker's a fucking asshole. He's never done a military day's work in his fucking goddamn fucking life. Yes, I'll send you some money. You want another uh, card? They used to, I used to send him those. Um... And I told him, you know I've got no money. I said, you're robbing food out my kid's mouth now. This is a bad move for you to make. You are telling the truth, aren't you? Oh, yes, I would never lie. Right, OK. So I became his next of kin. I believe someone says I'm married to him. I'm not married to him. I was never married to him. I only did that to catch the biggest scandal scam of the celebrity idols of the 1% Millionaires Club deliberately because now you're on the FBI, CIA, military, spiritually speaking, trained, got you by being in a garden of Eden with the dead people. Okay, so that's for you, my raff of a tiff taff chaff of the military downstairs that is the army the navy and the raf everyone's included in i'm the army i'm the army bitch i love you all used to be a sailor i was i started off as a private in the army then one progressed to a navy sailor and now i'm a fucking goddamn sas raf fucking bitch okay that's called progression now what happens in the military god's army is the same people look at this 
What happens in the army of any army of who's any army? You've got to start off at the bottom and work your way up, you goddamn idiots. <coughs> Sorry. Show myself. Now, this is what we're here for. Less we forget. Now, this is the rifle brigade. Now, if anyone knows anything about my voice, it's gone now because the devil doesn't want me to say all this. Now, what happens here is in the rifle brigade, kids, <coughs> these are the front ones. These are the ones who usually die. This is why in 1917, age 21, this poor person has died. He's a J pallet. Now, why did he die? Because he was a rifle brigade, which means he's on the front line like me. He can get shot at any time. That probably means in 1917, it would be Second World War, sir, is that right? I think, yep, Second World War. Which means he'll have been in the trenches. The Second World War was a slaughterhouse. It was nearly as bad as the one they had in America. <coughs> it doesn't want me saying this book. I don't have to get a drink. <coughs> I don't give a shit, Satan. You're fucking dead, man. I don't give a shit what you say. This is why you're not the boss and I fucking am, you motherfucker. <coughs> I fucking hate you, Satan. Just give me a minute, I'm not switching the camera off. I'm going all the way from the start to finish. See what it's like to work for God. This is Joe's and fucking job. Just give me a minute while I just fucking choke on truth. Well, Satan does. I'm not. I know this is truth. Get out of my fucking life, Satan. Right. So I do apologise, I've gone a bit hoarse, I've turned into a horse in the military now, don't forget the fucking animals at the military, because they don't even have a voice. The dogs are the fucking canines, they're the fucking, they're the ones you want to be looking after, the fucking dogs. God's dogs. I haven't forgot your canines, don't worry. So that's, that's, that's what I'm standing up for, actually, is the silencing of what they've done to the fucking God's dogs, who are actually looking after the boys in the army. So... The Rifle Brigade are the ones in the trenches. And then we had that whole fucking disaster. I will never forgive you, America and Korea, for doing what did you do to my men. Shall I tell you what you fucking did? Pearl Harbor. Oh, I haven't forgot that, Satan! No, I haven't! I think Bush was under that. <coughs> I'm not shutting up, Satan. I'm not shutting up! You want to fuck off! See, this is the fight me and Satan have all the time. He fucking hates me. Fuck you, Satan. I don't give a fucking shit. I'm going to grab your fucking goat horns and ram them up your ass. Dad's told you to fuck off. Get out of our lives. And I'm talking for the dead people today and the alive people. God help you, Satan. And you, Mr. Fucking Flump of a fucking rump. You're a rump steak. I speak the goddamn truth and I will be respected if it's the last thing I do on earth. You will respect my father's fucking name. Ugh. So I have to deal with every fucking day. Live on fucking camera, choking because of Satan's fucking trying to stop my throat chakra again. Not under my fucking dead body. Over my dead body. Under my dead body and around my dead body. I'm dead anyway, Satan. Now you're going to fucking kill me. You can't kill a fucking dead man. Fucking goddamn asshole interrupting my fucking graveyard speech. Fuck you. <sighs> ah, I think that's worked. He's gone. Shala! Tell him what sell it, Kamala! Tell your pigeons to take that and put it in a fucking pipe! That's what we call <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Nobody sees me do these things on camera. Well, you're not seeing my fucking face. That is how you rebuke Satan and send him back to hell. Oh, I feel better now, he's gone. Motherfucker sending them pigeons to fucking spy on me and ruin my fucking time in the graveyard. Every time I come, he fucking turns up. See, motherfucker. See what happens? See what happens? Do you see that? 1947 on the fucking clock. Now that's why I'm the boss, bitch, and you lot are still getting your nails done. 
I'm trying to look pretty for the camera, ready to do a card reading. This is God's work. So sit the fuck down and leave us military people, spiritual and on the ground, to get on with God's job. Stay out of the goddamn way. And if that Trump says anything else, he's got me to answer to. Fucking motherfucking assholes. One more soldier, there comes in my face, and you're all going down like a load of dominoes. <sighs> fucking goddamn sick of these motherfuckers. Every fucking day. No more after this day, it's the 1st of June. And this is the end of military week. Of lest we forget why we're doing this. This is why I get up every goddamn day to do this fucking job, soldiers, assholes. All right, big gangster man, you sold yourself a 50 cent and a fucking whap. The lot of you. You shagged too many people in the 90s, you're out of here. Get Margie Mark if anybody's coming, it's the only one I'm fucking talking to. He's the only one with a god voice. You're all fucking shoving each other's up the ass, trying to play me on fucking line. Oh, did you have a bet on? Well, here's a bet. Fuck you. Two fingers. It's a finger fork. <coughs> <coughs> fucking celebrities. Goddamn celebrity assholes! You don't even know what work is, you fucking idol! Is that all right? You're getting your attention now! Mr. Trump! White House boy! Turning my fucking White House fucking black. Do you know how many fucking soldiers I fucking lost in that Iraq war? Exactly. Back the fire. I'm fuming with him. Oh! That's a good job. The good church is fucking... It's all right, thanks for that. Fairly, I feel better, yes. Oh! And now we can go back up to heaven. Thanks, Dad. Bring it down to you, because I'm telling you now that motherfucking Satan's gonna wish he never met me! I'm telling you, you want to take me on. Spreading lies, you're gonna come back in my life and do what, Asian boy? Go on, I dare you! Bring the whole of Africa! Big men, black men, with your big cocks! You fucking got a bigger cock in your fucking head! Pfft. Fucking scum. Oh, they're all big men. Oh, you want to play with the big boys? Well, here's one, me, the little fern bush that you've all ignored for the last 24 months you've had to say sorry. 24 months you've all had to look at me and come and say something. And not one of you has in the whole of fucking Birmingham, the whole of the world has ignored me for the love of money. I'm keeping every penny to myself. Nobody gets a cent unless I say so. Clarification confirmed, sir! Now this is what you have to do if you want to be in the military of any kind. You cannot be a bloody asswipe, sucky sucky, cocky cocky, 50 cent whapper in any army! That's why you need a voice that's trained to tell people what the fuck to do! It's called military training on the 3D plane. Okay, have I got your attention? Or do you want me to do this again tomorrow? And the day after, and the day after, and the day after. Send fireman fucking Sam, send the fucking police, send the fucking I don't give a shit! Because you've got no authority on earth, I win! If you want me to say win. It's not a competition. That's why I win, because I was never playing. Because I wrote this with my dad. Even this here is divinely destined for me to be here today. I'm not angry. I'm not upset. I'm doing God's job. And somebody, do you know who Satan is? Have you tried to, oh sorry, you do. Because you're stuck in what? Satanism, occultists, addictions, sex, rock and roll, and the drug life. Wow, wow. So you do know who Satan is, and that's why you hate me, because why? Because I'm godly and you're saintly. Not saint. You're a saint hand worshipper. You hate yourself. That's it. Done. Feel better now. I do feel better for early. Thanks for that. I needed that today. Because they're still fucking trying. Oh, we set the alarms off. Now, you... 
have tried to play me again last night and all this week in Memorial Week. You sent me to the NHS. You're full of bullshit. I've got the Asians who I'm renting accommodation off. Full of bullshit. Everyone's full of bullshit. The whole of Birmingham is cursed because of you. Well, not the whole of Birmingham. There is some godly people here, but I do. God help you if you've had my mate. I'm going to watch you all fall. I'm just going to stay where I am in that house that I now own, by the way, landlord. It's my house. You can sign the deeds over to me. I'm taking over that house. I own that house. Get out. You t- you get out. It's my fucking house. I own the land. So that means I'm the landowner of the house owner. Tell Mr. Raj with his, oh, look, I'm a lord of Hansworth, that him and his wife are going to go to prison for selling prescription dr- drugs from the pharmaceutical company all around Hansworth and Birmingham because Mr. Raj with his cowboy hat who hit me, who hit me! with a dog lead and I had to jump on his back and bite him. He is one of the top ones selling the pharmaceutical company around Birmingham and that's what they don't want me to tell you. There you go. Fernley, I think I've done a good job today, Sam. I think that's fucking well done. I've enjoyed myself. Now I'm gonna turn the camera off now that I've done God's work and I'm gonna spend a little bit of time with my dead family because I like the dead better than I like you lot. All right, so thanks very much for your time. I salute you all. Well done. God's army. Keep fucking going. Don't worry about it. I've got this shit. I think you can see now I am some sort of maybe a squad leader. What kind of squad? Well, we're in the Scooby-Doo squad. Where's fucking Shaggy? Tell her to bring some more snacks. I'm hungry. I've got no money and I can't go out for something to eat tonight. But it's all right because I do have food in the house. I'm not starving, obviously. But it would be nice if Satan wasn't such a dickhead and you rich celebrity assholes sitting with your fucking steak and chips while I'm going to eat free food that I've been given of somebody who's still trying to kill me and wants my money. But that's okay. Don't worry about me. It's all right. It's just cat. I'll remember this. And so will the whole world when they see what you've done to me. There you go. Leaving me on a 9.22 minus in my bank. You Deadline was Friday. You missed it. And now you're all fucked. Again. We'll do the same thing again tomorrow. Sunday's a good day. I love a good family day. And we'll see what happens tomorrow. Hooray, hooray, hurrah, hurrah. Lest we forget, honour the dead, and the word I'm trying to tell you all is respect. Do you think we can learn one word? Stop fucking reading books. It's out of your intelligent level. Respect. All right, back to the teacher. I'm just repeating myself. So, respect. Until you can do that, you're not welcome in my life. That's the negative side. The positive side, thank you very much for standing up and helping me. I love you. We've got this. Let's roll with the next day. I don't know what's happening tomorrow. I wasn't expecting to do this. I just came to see Fernie. Okay? Love you all. Goodbye. Over and out from the crazy, yet very sexy, beautiful boss bitch of NAA, anointed officially to annoy everybody. And I think I'm fulfilling my prophecy. (laughs) Bye.